MBH mobile scope is composed of two parts, the monitor and the operation parts. And the monitor is compatible with different operation parts. Today I will show you how to use MDH mobile scopes. First, how to install the batteries. Unfasten the screws with a screwdriver. And push out the battery cover. And install three AA L-Cry battery according to the direction marked in the battery pack. Be careful not to put in the wrong direction. And close the battery cover. And fasten the screws with the screwdriver. And next, I will show you how to connect the operation part with the monitor. Make sure there is no foreign object between the connecting place of the operation part and the monitor. You see, there are two sticks on the operation part and two holes on the monitor. Push the two sticks to the two holes and screws to the left. Be careful not to perform too much force, otherwise forceful force push will damage the sticks on the operation part. And also, screws tight on the monitor, otherwise the loose connecting may affect the image quality. There is a power switch on the screens. Short press the button to turn on the device and long press for 3 seconds to turn off the device. Because there is no automatic shut off function, so after use, you should turn off the device in time. And next to the power switch, there is a low battery indicator. Usually, it is green. When it becomes orangey or fresh, it means low battery. You should change the batteries in time. And now I will show you how to adjust the white bearings. There is a white bearings button on the right of the screen. If you feel a normal or unsatisfied image on the screen, you can perform the white bearings to get better image. Point to the distal ends 3 to 5 mm to any white object and at the same time keep pressing the white bearings button until the image on the screen is normal. And now we will check the angulation range of the distal end. You can see there is two index next to the control level. D means down, U means up. The angulation range of the distal end is 113 degrees up and 113 degrees down. Avoid forceful or excessive angulation in case of the stretching and tearing of the wires. And now I will show you how to correctly hold the grip section. The up and down control knob can be controlled by the thumb and the suction value can be operated by the index finger. Do not hold the operation part too low or too high or on the opposite side. 